Hello everybody and welcome back to XCOM Enemy Within where we are in Egypt on a terror mission and we see this little gaggle of floaters that doesn't realize we're here so I'm gonna try to take advantage of that here. Um, so let's move with Joya over to a cover spot to get a better look at uh, their situation and maybe try to snipe them with Jake. Uh, but wait a minute. There is a cyber disc here with a drone buddy. Uh, these are cap capable of repairing them. I think I took out the drone or something in the last encounter with the cyber disc. But if you can't take out the cyber disc in one turn, you usually want to get the drone because he can re basically heal it. Um, let's see. Let me move up with Austin, I guess. Uh, rescue this civilian in the process. I don't need to be moving into full cover with him because he gets full cover even in low, but uh, in that case it's just the best spot I feel like. So uh, since I can't see the cyber disc with Jake, I'm going to go for this shot and um, oh, okay. You can't crit unless you headshot with enemies you're seeing in squad sites, so uh, in this case it's 100% chance to crit because he's out here in the open and doesn't realize Jake is here. But he'll realize, well he won't realize it, but his buddies will. He never knew. Party's over boys, Jake's in town. Alright, since they decided to group up, uh, I would double tap just to take advantage of it, but since Jake's already a colonel, and since Michaela's already a colonel, I'm not going to use her rocket or grenades. I'm going to use Brian's, and I could probably hit them from here. If the camera would quit, yeah, I could get them from here. But, thing is, I, uh, I want to move up, I guess, and shoot in the same turn if I can. And I also don't want to awaken that thing. So let me see what happens with Charity when I move right here. Okay, she doesn't see it. So uh, Brian should be able to move here. Position confirmed. Okay. I'm trying not to activate the cyber disk. And let's grenade the stupid camera. Why are you doing that? Oh my god, this is annoying. Okay, we'll get them both in one shot here for him. Nice. Two for one. And, uh... Good God. Okay, I want to make sure I don't pass the mech. So let's get right there. Okay, now I'm going to overwatch with the people that didn't shoot. And, uh... Jake, what, why is he doing this? Can't, oh, he was on double tap and I didn't use it, and now there's nobody for him to see. So I'm just going to end the turn forcefully. Uh, what's... What the hell? I think I just caught the AI in a cheat. I think it doesn't realize I can see it. Because of my invisible people, and so it did some weird teleport thing. Now the cyber disk is somehow sitting in there in Overwatch. So does that mean cyber disks Overwatch you, like, just by being there? I have no idea what that means right there. Um, let's see. I guess I'll get Joy on a spot to spy. Let's get her right here. The cyber disk is somewhere in there. Oh, good God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, the bad thing about me choosing uh, close combat specialist with her is if that thing moves, she's going to shoot it and reveal herself, so in hindsight, that was a bad decision to give her that. Um, Austin will stay invisible if I move with him, so let's get him into this low cover. Now this is seriously OP, being able to use low cover, but it is awesome. Okay, so, uh, with Jake, he's got his depth perception, so I would like to move to the roof, but he's not going to be able to see that. Hmm. 
He's not going to be able to see the stuff directly under there. That's is what I'm saying. Even with this. Yeah. Uh, let's see. I'll move with him last. Make a decision based on the situation. Okay, so. Let's see if I. I'm going to run here with Ryan. See if anything happens. Nope. Okay, I'll probably leave him in Overwatch then. And I'll start working my way in with these two. Let's see, move. Michaela will stay behind here in the full cover and go into Overwatch. And Charity will kind of come in between everybody. Uh, let's see, would that be? Right here's where I want to go. I hope it doesn't activate it. Okay, good. So, that means Jake can safely move. And it looks like that area there didn't activate anything, so let's get him right just as far as possible. Well, he saw something. Oh, because of squad sight. Okay. Okay, Overwatch for you two. You three. Okay. Okay, this is gonna hurt. Oh, this is what I didn't want to happen. I hope it doesn't encourage it to turn around and shoot her. Okay. I got a miss. I got another miss. And I hope this means she gets the uh, hyper reactive pupils to give her another sh to give her better shots during my turn. I don't know if it works. Man, what is it with all the misses? Maybe it's because it's flying, actually. Oh, God. Holy crap. Uh, hi, everybody. So, we need a rocket in there. And a grenade. You can. Oh my gosh, she gets to th have this thing trigger several times? That's beautiful. Okay, well, Michaela's critically wounded. We've got to get back there. Probably going to kill a civilian this turn. The rocket launcher. Okay, Michaela, we'll get to you, but first things first, we've got to take care of this taunting cyber disc, whatever the hell he's doing. Yikes. Okay. Okay, he's got a hundred percent chance to hit with the pistol. First, um I think I can take a free shot with Brian on this. So let me do that. Alright, eight damage, we need eight more. Now, I can run this turn or grenade. Okay, can I get a grenade in a spot that won't kill that civilian? Maybe I'm going to have to move with Austin, too. Um, actually, I've got an idea. Let's see. Probably be taking out that drone. Um, let's see, 81, 79, 79. I think Joya can take care of this one by herself. Uh, actually... Can you take out these? Okay. Okay, lovely. Lovely. New plan. I'm gonna have Joya kind of move just a bit away from that one and shoot the one that's uh, not hurt. So Moving over like this, please. Oh, what? That's uh, gonna complicate things a lot more. Oh, this map. Okay, I do want her to get one of the kills, so I'll shoot with her last and do this. With Ryan to take these out. Oh, 
Nice. Now, she should get this. Yes. Yes, please. Okay, nice. Okay, those floaters might be a problem. But... Jake will be a guaranteed shot on that. So let's get it. Okay, we only need three more damage. Surely Charity can come up with that. Um, I'm gonna come right here with her. Come on now, come on now, 78%. Oh, thank God. Wow. Let's have alien grenades on them, that's interesting. Okay, so next turn she needs to go stabilize her. And I'm going to use this turn to take out the drone with Austin uh, up to five. I'm going to go with the crit chance just to make sure it dies. Okay, now those floaters might have their way with one of us. Just be gentle. Be very gentle. Or kill civilians, I, I'll take that. No offense, civilians. Alright. Okay, run over there and rescue her, please. Thank you. God, it'd be nice to have her right now. Have the heavy abilities. Okay, you need to reload. In fact, I have the whole team needs to reload. But first, let's just make sure we get this. Oh, thank you, my man. Alright, we got one more to worry about. But she is very hurt, so what I might have her do is kind of run back here, rescue somebody, and reload. Or not. I guess you got to be facing them for that. She needs to reload and be healed by charity then. Um, maybe I'll get, have this be a turn where I get Jacob high. We need to just take care of this floater actually, so I'll probably just go into Overwatch with him. And let me see if I can find it with Brian here. Hey there. Uh, wow, you have a... I don't want to waste a grenade on it, so I'm just going to try to shoot it. Oh, nice. Alright. Starting to come in handy. Okay, four civilians have died, so not very good. But, uh, we're out of... Look, look how destroyed this building got from that firefight. So I guess with Jake... Will this rescue the civilian? No. Well, I mean, you don't really need to reload, but so be it. Ah, oh, God, this is ridiculous. Oh! There's more chrysalids. Zombies are being made. Okay, let's get Joya healed. Oh, they're both saved in that one move. Very nice. Uh, heal her, please. Okay, so I didn't use a med kit. I just stabilized her. I guess anybody can do that then. Or maybe just a medic. Wait, what is... Can be revived. Okay, I see. She's down to two now. It, must, it didn't update earlier. So there's probably aliens this way. Obviously killing zombies. Uh, but let me just clear out this room first, just to make sure I don't leave anything behind me. So, let's work our way over there. And Brian definitely needs to uh, reload, so let me just kind of have him stand in front of this door and do that. Ready to engage. Okay. I'm gonna do the same thing with him. Guess I'll go uh, invisible just for fun and reload with him. 
Reloaded. Okay, you can. I I didn't mean to press that button. I pressed a horror accidentally. Um, let's. Okay, we can only get one in, so I want to make sure she stays invisible. So let's run up here with her. And I guess I got Jake, uh, as far as I can this way. I want to try to get him in a good spot, but I'm afraid to get him on the roof of these, because, uh, there's not a whole lot of room on the ground. I don't feel like Jake's ever going to get a good... Oh! Hello! Another cyber disc and drone. And he's on Overwatch. Lovely. Well. Okay, Charity's kind of outside the action here, and the thing went into Overwatch, but it would be nice to suppress it and not have to worry about that. Um, do you see it? Okay, so he can probably move into a spot and shoot it. We're in another awkward situation here. And we don't even see the cyber disc, it looks like. 100% chance on the cyber disc. 100% crit. Let's go with that. 10 damage. You are lovely. Okay, so it's not an Overwatch anymore, is what that should mean. And Brian should be able to punch this to death. God, I hope that's the case. One way to find out. Um, if it's floating, can you punch it? Either way, he should have a very nice shot on it. So it does have Overwatch right now. What the hell? I guess he can be critted again, then. I mean, they missed anyways, so thank God. Yeah, it, it's like impossible to crit it when it's closed up. But now that it's open... And he can kinetic strike. Oh, yes. This is going to be so satisfying. Get out! Oh, <laughs> it blew up back there instead of blowing up on him. Okay. That's nice to know for the future. That was just lovely. Okay, then. The drone can do damage, but not much. So I'm just going to get up as far as I can here and try to kill it. Um, I believe my lowest ranked person is Joya. Yeah. So I'm going to try to get the kill with her. So I'm going to run and gun. Run him down. All the way up underneath this thing. Shoot it. Goodbye. All mission objectives complete. Oh, that was it. Okay. Well, Michaela got very badly hurt, but other than that, it was okay. Considering the what I had thrown at me, I feel like I did really well. And if that mission taught me anything, it's that I really need to upgrade my weapons. Besides just the laser ones, I need that plasma research to finish fast. Nobody got promoted, and the kid was only gone for six days, that's impressive. And then three days. Uh, we got the drone autopsy. Remember, we okay. will be watching. I feel like that wasn't so bad. Okay, one day until the light plasma rifle is done. And I've got 25 meld to work with. And uh, did I already give... Yeah, I gave Michaela the, the pupils. Okay. So, uh, what's about to finish here? Okay, Illyrium Generator is almost done. So let me do that. So I can build the... Uh... Can I... Can I build this? Oh, let's see. The Nexus, even without power. So let me see if I get 250 bucks somehow. If I can go ahead and build it and then it just won't be powered on or something. Because I need to get that thing going ASAP. Oh, I also need to sell stuff to do it. Let's see. I don't need... Let's see, six floaters will be good because I want the dodge. Uh, I don't know if the cyber disc wrecks do anything for me. 
So I'll keep one. I want chrysalids because I want to make those uh, chitin plating for people. Uh, I haven't researched the drones yet. Okay, so I feel like I got a lot of alloys and Illyrium and fragments, but from my playthrough of the original game, that kind of becomes the limiting currency in a way when you're wanting to upgrade your weapons. So do these, but I really need the money. I also need power sources and computers for the what I'm wanting to build. Okay, let me go with. Don't patch that. Oh, God. No. We're here to track alien activity, not investigate haunted houses. Okay, I'm gonna sell that just because I really need the money. And let's see how this goes. So, can I build the Nexus? Not enough power. Yeah, it doesn't even let me be begin construction. Alright, well, it's almost done. And I'll just try to stop. Actually, I'll force stop it, so. There we go, instant. Well, not instant, but. Feels like it was. Illyrium generator complete. Okay, got some, some money and stuff back. Uh, yeah, I, uh, now I need to, so it's the 15th of June, need to get that nexus down, this will allow for five more satellites, and how long is it going to take? 21 days, damn, that's not fast enough, but I still need to build it, and we could stand to excavate a little bit, get a workshop, or get the foundry over here. So yeah, I definitely need to excavate that part. And we're plenty good on energy, but I will put a thermo generator here if it becomes necessary later and get some laboratories over here, but I don't want to spend the money yet, so I'm good with what we've done. Uh, I'll wait till the light plasma rifle's done and then we'll do the automatic autopsy on the drone. So let's go back here. And assign new research. Let's see. Yeah, our soldiers can now use them, and it's available for manufacture. Yeah. Okay, um... Yeah, here's the autopsy. This unit appears to be a drone, which is similar to the military drones we are familiar with. This particular example seems to have the ability to repair damaged equipment. Dr. Shen and I believe it should be possible to capture and repurpose these for our own use in the field. Uh, yeah, you can... Uh, well, we didn't learn anything from that, but you can build the uh, advanced art thrower or something. That you can upgrade the art thrower to take these things over, and then you can use them against people or against the aliens. Uh, let's see, is Titan armor is available? 19 days, so no way in hell I'm doing it yet. Uh, yeah, so I definitely need to prioritize. The plasma weapons. Now, okay, the plasma cannon is for interceptors and stuff. Let's see, five days, seven days for the pistol, eight days for the plasma rifle. Uh, I take it when I research this, I might be able to research the other plasma weapons, I hope here, but I also need to consider getting my interceptors upgraded. I think I'm going to go with uh, the plasma rifle, just because I have some, and then I can use it and do some more damage. And then I hope it leads to being able to get to the sniper and heavy gun. So let's go back. And uh, let's see how many... Actually, I'm curious how, what it costs to actually build those rifles. Uh, yeah, can't even... It's 140, so it's ridiculously expensive. This And look how many alloys and alerium it costs. This is why you want to capture these things in the field. Uh, apparently I have three, though, and I feel like that's almost enough. Because I'll usually have a couple snipers and a heavy, so I only need three. And then the mech, so I really only need two, don't I? So yeah, we're good there. 
Um, yeah, we got people sick and hurt and everything. Uh, let's see, do I need... Wait, covert operations. Insufficient cash to sweep. Unknown cell presence. Unknown cell presence. So these are just the areas that we know it's not in. Let me see what happens if I sell eight dollars worth of stuff. Um, okay. Uh, covert ops. Insufficient cash to sweep. Okay, well I need more cash, that's fine. Then I won't do it. So let's continue here. Hope we get some people back soon. Oh, Exalt Operation, interesting. Uh, Egypt panic increased. Exalt agitation has increased panic. In a place I just reduced it. What a, the Exalt cell is exposed for now, but we'll go into hiding soon. Uh, let's go to the Situation Room, I guess. Let's see. Exalt base is not in an English-speaking country or Egypt. I guess we just figured that out, maybe. Uh, so Covert Operation. Let's send our guy there. I mean, Jake would be good because he's got the pistol upgrade, but I like using Tyler because he's fast. I guess I should probably upgrade it. But I mean, I like him for a sprinter. I should probably upgrade a snapshot sniper to do this. That way he gets the, uh, or a squad sight sniper, or just a sniper that's good with pistols. But uh, let's use him. Give him a laser pistol. Uh, let's see here. I don't want to hear anything else about. I guess I could get this because you'll be on your own. We don't have time for alien dog fights. And yeah, Covert so you. Operative deployed to disrupt exalt cell in Egypt. Okay. Um. So in uh, Asia is about like uh, all on the verge of panic. Not that it matters because I'm I've lost the bonus here anyway. But I do have satellites over these two countries, and I don't really want to lose the income. I'm gonna have a lot of hard decisions coming up. At least we've got some vets on our side. It takes a serious pair to go face to face with one of those things. Okay, so back to mission control and continuing on. All right, Joy is back. Complete. Oh, whoa. okay, all my soldiers are back, I believe. Very nice. So excavation is done. Can I build the foundry yet? I think I can. Yes, it is 75 bucks. Well, that seems easy to come by with all the crap I've got sitting around in here. So. Maybe I've got so many alloys, I just feel like I'll never run out. I'm probably going to run out later and people will be laughing. Let's go with this. Uh, so I only needed 25 more. Let me put those back just for now. Okay. Let's build that thing. Yes, that. Uh, maintenance, fine. Okay, uh... I'll have labs coming in. Well, a couple labs here eventually. Uh, so this spot will be saved for another generator. I guess I might as well excavate this now since I'll probably want something there later and then I'll be mad because I didn't excavate it. So let's go back to the situation room and sell some stuff. I feel like I need this many muton corpses. Uh, let me go down to 12 just to be safe, just in case I get a, an order for one from somebody. Uh, let's do something like that. Three, I need uh, nine more, so take it out now, always. That'll be it. Okay, excavate. Very good. And let's go back to mission control and continue. And we've flown through this month. I'm kind of worried. Contact detected. Never mind. Well, let's go get this. 
Uh, you both have Phoenix cannons, so I don't think it matters. This ought to reduce panic, at least over China, but maybe maybe over all of Asia. I hope. Catch it, please. Okay. Now, since I don't think we need aim helping having a plasma cannon, but we probably need to dodge since we got to get in close. I'm gonna wait for the last second here. Okay, didn't need any help. Maybe I don't need plasma cannons. Okay, let's send the Sky Ranger. And it looks like our A team is back in action. Uh, so, let's get rid of these uh, laser weapons. Care pace. Yes, we can carry these now. Now, the only difference it's 4 to 6, 8 to 10, 10 crit chance. And you will notice exactly the same. The difference is. Uh, plus 10 aim bonus, so I'll take that over what the laser rifle provides. But uh, so yeah, the plasma, the regular just plasma rifle is definitely better. But uh, these are better than the laser weapons, so we're sticking with it. Okay, can't really do anything about the snipers and the heavy though. Or the mech. And... Yeah, I guess I'll have them keep their arc throwers and stuff. Just because I really want to get some plasma weapons now. Uh, and I don't need light... I definitely don't need light rifles anymore. It could be that someone requests them and then I wish I had them, but... I'm only going to get them if they fall into my lap, like I said before. I would like to go with the shotgun and everything, but as you can see, it's almost definitely not worth it since it's 3 to 5 damage and this is 4 to 6 but also has a better range with it so uh, we'll stick with that I forgot she's got the gene mods guess we'll go with that okay uh yeah, I don't have the plasma pistols yet, so we're going to have to do it like this. Um, this being a UFO mission, I could use this mission to train people up. But that means I'd have to get rid of one of these, too. Eh, you know what? I can get rid of you for now and have uh, Jang come on this mission. Yeah. I'll have him come instead. And... I want you to have grenades. Yes, I think I do. Uh, let's make items available. Carapace armor on you, and I guess we'll have you We got plenty of alien grenades, I guess, but we'll get we'll use them up. But they'll be infinite later when we research it and everything. Okay, so that's good. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty awesome. Okay. Yeah, I like this. So let's. So yeah, I only really need two, but I've got three, so we're fine on light plasma rifles. There weren't any heavy or regular plasma rifles to catch on that last mission. There were no mutons. So hopefully there's mutons here and we can try to capture one or two of them. We have visual on the mission site. Setting down. I know I've got at least one rifle, so I feel we're like one more operation. <coughs> like Our target went down two in more mutons mutons captures will guarantee I don't need to deal with more. Cover any survivors. But one more probably. Because I think I've already got one sitting besides the one that I captured. So, feeling pretty good about that. Central, this is Big Sky. Okay, let's see. Let's see. Whoa. Copy, Big Sky. Right here in the Strike corner of the map. To attempt the breach. Okay, let's see if we can find any meld. I don't see any, but here's the UFO. Okay, well, we'll continue toward the UFO next time on the next episode. Thanks for watching.